Yes. Um, while in London, we uh, found out that there's a uh, Inquisition um, chamber to see, so we decided to come past and uh, explore that a little bit. This is these are ancient books, still from the Inquisition. Some some letter of I can't read it in, in Latin, but it looks like some the the the, the letter for uh, the permission to make an Inquisition. And here the bust of the uh, Thomas de Tocumada. He was the Grand Inquisitor from the time of Ferdinand and Isabel. And some other pictures here you see that uh, portray the same thing. And as we continue on further, we find the actual um, torture machines that we use. This one is called the rag. And uh, this actually puts the I had the people's person's hand here and they, they would stretch it with by, by turning the wheel and sometimes they would break limbs of the people at, while, while they were at it. Um, I'm not sure what this one is, but this we also know is this they call this is very interesting because this one is called, actually called the Judas Cradle. Now can you imagine what that means? I mean, the Jewish Seat, or the one that was commit was was, was uh, the one that was um, the one that was being uh, interrogated for being Judaizing. I had to sit on such a seat with nails, and while they turned it um, and tortured him until he would confess that he did Judaize. If you look around, you can see the famous, uh, the famous, the famous Morano that was caught with the shame hat and then they would either give him one more chance or they would, say, they would take him out to the auto de fe and he would burn the, be burned at the stake. Most of the times the torture was done that they should give names from other people which should give all the torture and that's how they uh, got more and more people with names on the, to, to torture. This I'm not sure what that is but these are all different machines of torture that was used. Oh here we have another one. This was the one that was used to hang the guy by his by his to, to, by his shoulder, and then they would with this thing they would hold him up and uh, and then yeah break him until he would he would say he would say some name. This was a head crusher, believe it or not, that uh, made a lot of was very painful. So this also got people to talk, I would imagine. And here you go when I get one of them chairs. Interrogation shit, it's called, and uh, yeah, and I guess this is where they kept the people, as uh, when they when they brought them out for display, and while they were they were ordered to be to be killed. So this was the Inquisition room. In Ronda, if you have in Ronda, it's worth coming by and seeing it. Yeah, oh, this this is the uh, this is another one of them torture machines. Which works with a screw, and they put the head in here, and then they would, they would turn it, the back of his head, to, to, that would make it extreme. It would be extremely painful. It could even cause death by uh, asphyxiation. The <laughs>